What's going on guys? Nick Hellman here, aka the Crypto Hitman, here to talk to you about a Pulse Chain altcoin. This isn't the first time I've talked about this asset, and it won't be the last. Also, there will be a couple other assets that we inevitably discuss whenever we talk about the Gray's currency. So let's jump right into it. As you can see, Pulse TGC, the Gray's currency, relatively unknown, only 1,348 followers, but that is because Pulse Chain itself is still relatively unknown. People are starting to chatter about it, but are they really bridging in their assets? Have they really gone hard into the ecosystem? Well, the answer is no. And the fa mere fact that you're watching this video tells me you're already in Pulse Chain or you're thinking about it. And if you haven't already gotten into the Gray's currency, Pulse Chain, or any of the, these other assets I talk about, now is the opportunity to get ahead of the curve. Get in before the masses. That is where the real gains are. Now as for Pulse TGC, why am I bringing it up? There's a couple interesting things that I'm discovering within the blockchain itself and of course the price points of the Gray's currency. On top of that, I pulled the Richard Hart and I called the bottom on this once again. Let's pull up the chart. As you can see, we've given several buys, all at great places, up 595%, 704%. In the live show, I gave you guys another opportunity right here, up 162%. But what is this white arrow? This white arrow, I publicly went into our private group at patreon.com slash learn crypto and gave yet another buy, telling everybody in there, at some point, you need to buy this asset. I don't care if you missed our other entries. Timestamps don't lie. February 5th at 2.34 p.m. If you missed the first entries in PTGC, this is a dip I would be getting ready to buy. Realize this is still quite a bit higher than our buys, but at some point you need to get entries. This red bar was primarily from one whale seller. Look at that price. Look at that price. Look at the results. Whoa, there is one I posted. We only went, what, 1%, 2% lower than that? When I was analyzing this, this is organic sell-off. This was due to the nature of Pulse Chain itself, Pulse X, Teddy Bear getting a little bit of a pullback. If you understand PTGC, it is tied in liquidity pairs to many of the best performing assets over on Pulse Chain. When those assets go higher, so does PTGC. When those old assets have volatility and volume goes to the Gray's currency here, then Pulse PTGC gets more treasury, which most of the time they're using to add to LPs or they're buying back and burning their own token. Now, as for this final capitulation here after this minor rally, I looked and I analyzed the data that we're seeing here. That is why blockchain is awesome and why stocks are corrupt. I noticed that this was primarily due to one whale wallet selling 50% of his position all in one market sell. That correlated with the top and ABC drawdown and this being one seller with the, all the volume coming from that one seller, declining volume around it, told me to believe that that would be a major low. That is why I gave yet another buy. Now this rally here is coming on the back of Pulse Chain, having a great couple of days. Also Teddy Bear, the number one meme coin of Pulse Chain, going to new all-time highs. It is Hart's Law that since PTGC is paired with those assets, when they go higher, so does PTGC. Now this is where the unique utilities and the token functions of this token and why it can go on massive runs and outperform the blue chips of this ecosystem. Because volatility and volume breeds assets for the treasury. Not only by holding this asset do we receive reflection rewards simply by holding them the entire way. If you want to stake it, you earn double the asset rewards from the, the transaction taxes. But it goes further. Because a portion of the transaction taxes are going to the OA wallet, to the treasury wallet. And what do you know? I have that here on the Pulse screener. This is the Pulse Chain Explorer. This is the OA wallet, the treasury wallet of this great altcoin project. Now, why am I smiling a little bit? Do you see it yet? Do you see it? This wallet is currently holding 492,959,599 PLS. And earlier in this video, I told you that 95% of the time, 99% of the time, they're doing a buyback and burn with this money. Do you understand how much potential buyback and burn this is for PTGC? Let's do some math. Let's come over to PulseX. Use this platform because I love PLSX. And every time you use it, guess what? I make a little bit of money because the buyback and burn is a function of this. It sends the price higher and I get to buy myself a new pair of shoes. Now, let's see. 492 million. 
PLS. And that's rounding down here, folks. We know transaction fees aren't that high. What is that value? $61,155 of potential buybacks and burns of PTGC. That is massive. Do you know what that does to an asset with 800,000 liquidity? That'll be quite the green bar. And then you factor, you add to the factor of that, that that would be burned out of circulating supply and total supply of this asset forever. They've already burned over 8% of the total supply. This would add nicely to it. I hope they pull the trigger and do this soon. I think they have some kind of a plan. Let's get to a new all-time high here on PTGC. And let's, let's deploy those funds to get those green candles that everybody likes to see. Talking about all-time highs. Yep, it's not very far away. From here to the all-time high. We're only about 15 to 17% from the all-time high. If Pulse Chain has one more green day and PTGC decides to vote as a DAO to buy back and burn with a portion of all those assets, a new all-time high will be on this asset. What happens when we get to a new all-time high? All of the holders, all the shillers, all the influencers, all the KOLs in mass will be telling you, I told you so at the right time. What does that do? Creates more FOMO. And that's why we get those explosive Blue skies, no downward selling pressure, and this thing could rip and explode. Let's see what else they have in their wallet. 42 other tokens. As you know here, the 808, that's part of their ecosystem. Um, a lot of different LPs because that is the way they're functioning. They have the spider webs of LP where they're garnishing bots and transactions and volume from all these different popular assets on Pulse Chain. I did notice something else here. Probably a clerical error. $100 of USD coin. Not much, but if you're watching this, uh, the OA god of, of the Gray's currency, just go ahead and market buy with 100 USDC to let me know you're watching, and I'll appreciate that little bit of a market buy and to clear out the wallet of, of one token here. Exciting times ahead. Now, this brings me also to Alien. Why does it bring me to Alien? Alien has very similar token economics as PTGC. And guess what? It benefits PTGC holders, where a portion of the buy and sell taxes go towards doing what? Buying back PTGC. Oh, I love this ecosystem. And why do I say Alien? Well, for the people who think they missed it with PTGC, which I don't think you did, well, you can go here. Alien is sitting at a 1 million market cap and 100,000 liquidity. Now, why is this a sweet spot for me? I know we bought 600% ago. Yes, I gave you one. I gave you two. And I gave you a live sell buy right here on the live show right here across the breakout of this previous high. But why is this a nice, interesting point for me? This is about where I got involved in PTGC. About a million dollar market cap and the liquidity was somewhere around six figures as well. And look what it has done. 16.29 million about to go to a new all time high and liquidity at 750,000. Does Alien follow in the footsteps of PTGC? I don't know exactly. But I do know that the utility and the functionality and the LPs work very similarly. And I also know that by owning Alien, it bolsters my position in PTGC. So why not get into this, especially at this stage? That's why I bought it down here. And this is just a sweet spot. You guys thought you're, I, I gave you the call late when PTGC was a million. Now it's 16 million. Well, what do you know? Now Alien's a million. Will you miss this one too as you watch this go to 15 million? The decision is up to you. These are two altcoins that I love to hold in the post chain ecosystem. Why? Because simply by holding, I benefit from the success of all of the other major blue chips and major brands in the post chain ecosystem. I don't want to focus on all those, have my bag spread out that much, and trading all those assets. Buy this. I hold this. I earn rewards. Teddy Bear goes to a new all time high. Great. PTG goes up. Pulse chain goes to a new all time high. Great. PT PLS goes up. Great. Alien does well, great. We are getting exposure to the top assets on Pulse Chain by holding this one asset. That's the name of the game. That's the play. And that's why we're already up 16 to 17x. Peace.